Hello everyone, I hope you are doing well. This is the ninth video of the basic practice teaching series, a new series aiming to introduce some fundamental practice aspect of different internal styles of martial art, Xiu Dao and Qigong. So far, I have been focusing on posting martial art videos and soon I will cover other topics as well. In today's video, I will work with my student Simone to demonstrate how to generate martial power by utilizing the opening and the closing motion of the chest area. We all know that Kai He or opening and closing motion is the key practical aspect of any Chinese internal style of martial arts, especially Tai Chi. Past practitioners such as Chen Xin, one of the most important Tai Chi figures in history, even said, quote, Kai He Xu Shi Ji Wei Quan Jing, end quote. Translation, opening and closing, substantial and insubstantial are martial classics, end translation. In other words, Tai Chi practice includes Kai He, or opening and closing, which represents the most important aspect of a Tai Chi. Of course, the term Kai He or opening and closing has a much more profound meaning than its face value. But no matter how deep a topic may be, you have to start from the basics, which is the reason for me to shoot this video. For a detailed explanation of the Kai He or opening and closing concept, check out my video titled Internal Style Concept 23 Kai He Opening and Closing. The link is in the description. Also, I'd like to remind you that even though in this video I focus on the opening and closing movement in the chest area. It should be done in coordination with other body parts, which I will introduce in more detail in the future. So, pay attention to the whole body coordination while working on the chest area. I can't emphasize this enough. A principle without a specific movement will keep your understanding at a superficial level. So, what you can do is just practice this movement while watching this video. By doing so, you will not only understand the principle but also master the movement. So, without any further ado, let's get started. Okay, let my student Simone to demonstrate one exercise. It is from the Chen Cell Force Routine, which is the third movement, O Liu Feng Si Bi. In this exercise, we emphasize on the opening closing motion of the chest and the coordination between the chest and the hip, which is the key practice of any style of Tai Chi. So, Simon, you can start from here, like this movement, until here. Yes, um, uh, from here. Oh, from here, sorry. One. Continue, two, then three. Okay, let me correct his moon one by one. Same time, I'm re-emphasize the important principle. So let's start from here. This is called warding off of Peng energy in Tai Chi practice. If you maintain this one, the Peng force should, here should down a little bit more, here should up a little bit. Peng force is not like this, it's the opposite, the opposite one. Knee pushes forward, you want to push forward, forward. Then, before you move back slightly forward again, then here's the Cai force, locking force. When the locking force, the front hand should have more strength, little finger point up, thumb downward a little bit, in order to strengthen this area. Then fingers, it seems like holding a palm here, so should the, point to, the finger open, point toward this area. And the focus at here, this area. Then, at here, then when you open the chest, so the elbow move in, palms move out. Be careful here. 
Let the, for the opening motion, the energy is from the chest. One. Then when the closing motion, the energy from the here and the back. So let re, you repeat this movement. The opening from the chest, closing from the back and the arm. And the higher, higher. lower, because the person this is here. Move up. And then elbow strike, turn a little bit. Then continue. Again from, uh, from here. Then open the chest, body turn to right. Then close, then body turn to left. No. Oh, left. Then, then use here to strike. A line here. A line here, okay? Higher, lower. And, uh, and then look at here, look at the, then sink down. Ready, then palm push backward, downward, then right forward. Yes, and the, the back foot make a backward arc in order to have a bumping motion with your right hip. Again, thank you. One, two, then three, four, then five. Back a little bit. Okay, yes, you see, in the end, then up ah, slightly. Now, from the very beginning, yes, one, intensify here, then two, open the chest, three, close, wave the chest and the hip, then shift the weight, sink down, ready, then push. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. I hope you all find this video beneficial to your practice. Thanks for watching, see you next time, and enjoy your practice.